Hey guys, now it's already 9 o'clock in the morning on Saturday. I'm catching up my uh, filming for yesterday. And also I'm catching up my workout for yesterday. But I only plan to complete four laps. laps around this two soccer field this morning because I need to come back to finish six laps for today uh, in the evening the so total will be 10 laps uh, that's probably uh, almost four miles uh, actually earlier today Trump already mad Xi Jinping to have a positive conversation. So nothing is a surprise uh, coming out of that meeting. So market may be holding at current level on Monday. The focus, the, the focus now switched to uh, the economic data which will drive the Federal Reserve to uh, decide whether they are going to cut 25 basis points in July or not. So 150% basis point is uh, definitely out of the picture and 25 basis points is uh, in question now actually. It's not 100% uh, probable. I mean, the probability of uh, cutting 25 basis points is not 100%. No. So yesterday, uh, to uh, uh, grow Along with the markets, possibly next week, uh, I built three stocks uh, into my uh, error account, in addition to the uh, uh, healthcare ETF I already bought uh, last Friday, uh, no, the week before. Uh, and uh, I don't want to take too much risk, so I bought the valuable or value stocks, which I consider undervalued now, uh, especially the Dow Chemical and the uh, Walgreen. Uh, Nike is not undervalued, but it's fair valued. Uh, yeah, now I'm going back home uh, to watch. Uh, Women's World Cup soccer game. Yeah, actually, the as far as you can tell, the turf is almost uh, all put onto the that soccer field, and uh, the turf is ready to be put onto this field. It's a nice day in Seattle.